Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Zero Mission Part 5. Green and lights. And we just ex we, I well, I just sequence break to get the super missile early, not not that I can use it that much because I only get two <laughs> by per tank. Still badass anyway. God damn it. I wanna s <laughs> I wanna shine spark, god damn it. Shine spark to victory. Are you actually doing this? There we go. Hell yeah. Oh, Jerome. Like a boss. Seriously, those purple flame things look derpy as all hell. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty well, much. Samus, Samus is here, what should I do? Super missile, bitch. And oh, all this is the room. This is the room where you need a various suit, otherwise you'll just keep taking damage whether you're in the lava or not. I think I actually did try to come in here without the various suit. I think I made it to the end. I think oh, I, really I think I did. I, taking too much damage. I think I did. <laughs> I'm not sure if I made it back out though. Yeah, you have to you have to you have to be able to get through here without taking a lot of damage. I don't what I mean by damage, I mean like from the enemies themselves. <laughs> Because you're already taking damage from the heat enough. Yeah, so you want to be quick. Oh, this part. This part's kind of bullshit, actually. Because of that. <laughs> but it's all worth it for super missiles. Actually, I did it wrong, I, uh, but I lucked out on jumping. <laughs> you're supposed to jump a little bit and then do the shiny spark so you can avoid falling through the floor. Like and get out of there. I like how there's a seahorse in lava. <laughs> that's sh that shoots lava at you. <laughs> it's not even a seahorse anymore, it's a, a magma th horse. It's a thing. That keeps spitting lava at me. Actually, it reminds me of those, um, those blobs of lava from Yoshi's Island. The blargs? N no, not the blargs. There's like this blob thing that shoots lava at you. Like there's a fish version and there's like a lava Oh, version. yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you're talking about. The lava version will want to KO you if it hits you. <laughs> yes. I mean, it is lava, so. Actually, and actually, when you think about it, Yoshi is surprisingly in, um, in, it's technically invincible in that game. <laughs> it's because of Baby Mario. <laughs> <laughs> it is. The only thing that kills him in one hit is lava and spikes and crush and getting crushed. Pretty much. The rest he can take it like a champ. Even getting even, even getting swallowed by a prana plant means nothing to him. He just jumps out. <laughs> Maybe they don't like, like the taste of Yoshi. It's like, bitch, I ain't your lunch. <laughs> Except that one fish that if it eats you, it's a one at KO. You mean, you mean the derpy as fuck fish? It's called a lunge fish. What a creative name. <laughs> the lunge fish. <laughs> I wonder what it's going to do. Burp. Well, but, well, as a kid, those things freaked me out, actually. Why? Because you never expected them. I never expected them. Uh. And and they make a cr and, they, and they make and then they make a like a sur uh, surprising noise when they when they actually lunge at you. Mm. Was there ever a shark type enemy in Mario? Uh, yes, there was actually. It was in it was in this one level in Super Mario 64. <laughs> and you won't get and then well they also make an appearance in the mario party games but uh they're called sushi oh yeah they're called sushi yes i know what you're talking about they're called sushi <laughs> 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 i know it's awesome right i'm not even mad <laughs> <laughs> i am not amused that it actually kind of reminds me of um, when you're in a, when you're in the Atlantis world in Kingdom Hearts One. It's, it's the under it's a boring it's a boring ass uh, world, but it's especially like kind of scary when you see a shark just come out of nowhere from behind you and start attacking you. Wow, that scared the hell out of me when I was a kid. Although strangely enough, I was able to play Jaws Unleashed. And not get scared. And not get scared. Well, okay, except when I saw the blue whales in the distance. That freaked me out. Um, Echo Dolphin? Anybody? Honestly, no. 
And I sequence break the screw attack. Echo the Dolphin really never really scared me that much, honestly. It just has some really annoying sound effects, that's for sure. It's, especially when I get one, especially when I got to the to the last boss. Well, the last boss. Okay, the last boss is just creepy. And what happens? I think you have to attack the, its jaw or something. You have to ram into its mouth, I think, or something. I don't know. Yeah, but if you time it wrong, it just eats you. Yeah, <laughs> which is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Anyway, so I got the screw attack, so, uh, screw all of you. <laughs> oh, yeah, I, okay, so I did I'm clapping break. for you in my mind. Okay, so I did sequence break, because you're supposed to use the speed booster to get up there. But I didn't. So you decide to blast the door open to not go through it. <laughs> yeah, so I don't have to blast it later. Well, you're certainly being efficient, I'll give you that much. Hey, you're doing a hell of a lot better than me, so... Fake lava? <laughs> I still don't understand that. That doesn't make any sense. <laughs> it's how do you hologram. fake? How do you fake lava? Hologram? And then when you fall through it, it's not there anymore. Yes. It feels like it was only your imagination. Ah, uh, don't turn this into one of those games. <laughs> Did it disappear? Or was he never there to begin with? Oh, there he is. <laughs> Tentacle things look weird. Yeah, but they're nothing to the screw attack. Well, it's a screw attack. Come on. What exactly are these things? What exactly are the tentacles supposed to be? Uh, they kind of look like alien plant life to me. Well, <laughs> the, the fake lava strikes again. God damn it, man! <laughs> and I sequence break the. Uh, well, I'm not sure if you get the weight beam now. I have a feeling Tyron's waiting to call me a giant hypocrite for complaining about video games. <laughs> Tyron, no, we... I, Tyron, I see what you do. Well, no, look. The difference is, when we when we question a video game, we have fun with it. <laughs> Tyron wants a logical answer. How does Metroid do what she does? <laughs> 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 Where does Metroid keep her? How does she curl up in a ball like that? Okay, well, actually, everyone asks that question. <laughs> Uh, the funny thing is to, um, this, yeah, that enemy had no chance. <laughs> but, um, anyway, uh, the, the actually, the space primers, because you know how there's logs in, um, in the, in the Metro Prime games, there's, like, there's, like, data logs they can read? Uh, some of the space parts, uh, data logs can be, uh, they actually have the, um, have some information on them attempted to do the more, you know, they try to, they try to, Draw, uh, draw. Please. You're morphing into okay. a robot as you speak. <laughs> That I can't help. <laughs> well, anyway, they try. They, anyway, they, they actually have data logs uh, of them trying to reverse engineer uh, Samus's weapons, and they try to reverse engineer her her uh, morph ball ability. And um, which, and it did not work. <laughs> did not work. Very apparently very grotesque results. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Like they have set up an interview and like it's like so Samus, how do you curl into a ball? She sat in for a second, like um, intense yoga. <laughs> 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 it's like um, it's a secret to everybody. I still do wonder how she actually does that though, because apparently in the Metroid in Metroid Prime, they show her turning into a ball of energy and then that's how it works, but. And they never showed in any of the other games. So. See, the th what, what I don't understand though is that does she does she does her does the ball form stay proportion to her like to her body, or is it or does it literally like shrink in size? Uh, it, from what I saw, it looked like it stayed proportionate to her body. Okay, so she so she's literally just doing intense yoga and just curling to a ball. Pretty much. Okay. Okay, now this section here always always tripped me up when I first played because I never realized you were supposed to lay bombs and let it roll over them. Yeah, actually... I so I kind of got stuck here a bit. If I timed it right, I would have won a KO Destiny. Like that. On the first try, but I didn't. And who would actually figure this out? <laughs> on their own? Uh, like I said, just sometimes it's just best to shoot at everything in this game. Well, I think, oh, I think it's a little more effective with the wave beam. Because um, beforehand you can shoot through walls until the wave beam. Get 
the missile. Good boy. Oh yeah, I think with the high jump you also get the jump ball. Oh, so you get both in one? Yeah, so it's... No, actually... Mm, actually, I don't remember. I don't think it's said. Because I know, I know in Fusion you get you get them together. Hmm. But I don't know if they mentioned it for this one. No, 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 I, I don't have the jump ball yet. Ah, I see. So it's, it's only in Fusion. And mini boss time. Oh yeah, this boss. I don't really like this boss. By the way, this is actually um, it's actually a sequence. Like first we saw the, the you know the caterpillar form, and now we're seeing it in a cocoon form. You'll see the uh, adult form in a sec uh, soon. And if you do what I did just now, you actually like kill off like half the boss already. And I timed it wrong. And now Jerome will never be a real boy. And here we go. Alright, now the other side. You just gotta wait for that thing to fly back over. Slow. <laughs> a few inches later. <laughs> two years later. <laughs> day two. Day three. Day four. <laughs> there we go. And that was a mini boss. And Samus just killed a murder. I mean, I mean, killed a child. Killed, killed him. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Wow. The murder was so intense that she had to kill it. <laughs> <laughs> Samus is just that badass. Oh god! Wow. I'm surprised. I'm surprised the world of video games was not exploded yet. First, we have video game version Batman. We have Samus. We have the Chuck Norris of video games, also known as Captain Falcon. Who's the Bruce Lee of Chuck of uh, video games? Um, I almost want to say Ryu. Maybe. <laughs> See, that's the same larva we just smashed away. No, it's still alive. I think at this point I realize I might have. No, actually, you're supposed to do this. He needs to go all the way to Ridley, go up to that room to activate to to to, to for that thing to be seen. And I come all the way back. See? Hmm. He needs to get in here from not Ridley. Why the hell is the area called Ridley? Because it's Ridley's place. <laughs> Ridley's lair. So they couldn't just call it Ridley's lair? <laughs> they have to no, call it his actual name? Yes, Ridley. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, this boss is piss easy. Yeah. Oh yeah, this is where you're supposed to get the super missile, actually. Well, if you stand directly right there, it's not gonna... It's gonna keep doing that. <laughs> Does it ever stop? No. You have to stand right there in order for it to, do the, you know, to keep doing that. So you essentially almost have to get hit. Yes. Get back here, you pussy. Just die already. Why are you still here? Ah, for fuck's sakes. There you go. Don't you hate when, you, when you, it takes a while, it takes forever for that fly actually, like, before like an enemy, before the boss finally dies, and he, when he realized it only took one more hit? <laughs> yeah, I hate that so much. Or when you're in like an RPG where you have to waste a healing item, but the, the boss only has like a sliver of HP left. Yeah. <laughs> I hate that so much. Final Fantasy, I'm looking at you. Basically any RPG, really. Uh, I think the, the, the only final boss I ever had a hard time with was uh, the Shadow Queen from Thousand Year Door. I, it's the th one thing I hate especially is when there's enemies that can regenerate health w during the middle of a battle. That pisses me off. <laughs> um, regular mooks, I don't mind. Bosses, yes. Because <laughs> half the time I kill all the, bo like the, the mooks in like one hit. 